So, Chris, the last time we did this, you swallowed a sword, you swallowed a hanger, and now you're gonna show us something else that you like to swallow? Yeah. These are my balloons. A lot of people think that swallowing a balloon would be safer than a sword, but it's not. It's just really? dangerous, yeah, in a different way because of two things. The first is shape and size. Swords are flat. This is, of course, cylindrical. That means that when I swallow it, it's taking up all the space inside my throat, covering my airway and not letting me breathe the entire time. Second, swords are solid. They're made out of metal, but this is soft and squishy. That means that if anything goes wrong, it would pop inside my esophagus, deflate, stick to my airway, and asphyxiate me in a way that not even the Heimlich maneuver would help. Oh. Mm-hmm. So uh, I like breathing. I'm gonna try not to let that happen. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna swallow it down to right about here, that's right outside my stomach. Gently bite down, pop it on the outside, and then hopefully the air will go up and out and I'll be able to safely remove the deflated balloon from my esophagus. Okay. All the time. Yeah. That's all I get. Yeah. Is dick pics. No one says me anything else but dick pics. <laughs> so last time I saw you, you swallowed a single sword, but now you have three swords. Yeah. I didn't even know people did this. Three swords. Oh yeah, people do way more than this. So the danger here uh -huh. is that they might scissor in my throat, uh, not my preferred style of scissoring. Uh, that would obviously lacerate my esophagus. That one just. just how long are the swords? So the shorter ones are 18 inches, and the longer one, I believe, is 23. Wow. Mm -hmm. Mm That's really gross. Wow. Let me clean it up. Bravo, <laughs> bravo. <laughs> That's incredible, three swords. I've seen two girls, one cup. I've never seen three <laughs> swords, one woman. <laughs> yep. 